now Steve Olenek. He's a sports attorney who currently represents a few of the Clippers players. And Lieutenant Colonel Alan West, who's a Fox News contributor and a former Florida congressman. Gentlemen, thank you both so much for being here. Steve, let me start with thank that because uh, Mark Cuban went on last night to talk about how he believes that trying to divest property from someone in any way, shape, or form because of something they said in the privacy of their own home, he said, that's not the United States of America, and I don't want to be a part of that. Have you heard that sentiment from anyone other than Mark Cuban in response to these remarks? I have not, Kelly. It's definitely heating up down in, I'm in Miami, and it's starting to heat up in the NBA, and I can tell you, I have not heard anything, but we do have the First Amendment. Now, these actual disclosures in terms of how these audio files were actually brought about, looks like there was a little bit of invasion of privacy as well. Well, if, if she taped him without his consent, then she's violated the law because California is a two-party consent state, as I understand it. And so that means both parties who are recorded would need to say, okay. And if that didn't happen here, then uh, she's violated the law. Let me ask you, uh, uh, Colonel West, the, the, the question tonight, no, no one is defending the remarks. Nobody is defending the remarks. Uh, the question is whether the, the deprivation of his property rights in terms of his ownership rights of, of, a, of a sports team, uh, you know, his financial livelihood, and the swift condemnation by every corner and basically t uh, taking away his livelihood is a slippery slope, as Mark Cuban suggested. Yes, you're absolutely right. It is a slippery slope because when you think about the fact that he was convicted uh, and tried in the court of public opinion, but as you just talked about in the court of legal opinion, uh, that that evidence that would not be admissible because it was a violation of the law in California. So the, you do have a sense of a slippery slope where all of a sudden do we have to be very concerned about what we say in private that it may be taped and of course it gets released to TMZ and it gets out there and then you're tried and convicted. This is really